Hi everyone, it's Tuesday and I'm Lori and you're watching The Beaver Bunch. <laughs> Man, does it feel good to say that again. Jess was not kidding. Um, I'm sure you all have seen her video and if you haven't, you totally should because she is like so cute. And uh, Mary Beth and I watched uh, her video yesterday and we were like, oh my gosh, Jess is so attractive. So <laughs> I'm sure you all agree. Um, so you should watch again if you already did. And uh, yes, looking forward to seeing all of the familiar faces of the Beaver Bunch this week. I saw Michelle and Cade a month or so ago and we were like, man, this feels so good. It feels so nice to see everyone doing good things and having, you know, great lives. And, um, and we know how much we enjoyed making videos back in the day uh, with all of you watching. And so we said, you know, we should do we should do this. We should do a reunion week, and everyone was totally excited about it. So, um, so here we are, and it feels so good. <laughs> There's been so many great things uh, that have happened in my life since I last spoke with you, which I it must have been more than two years ago. Um, I can't remember the last time. Oh my gosh, this is so great. So, uh, Mary Beth and I got married. Uh, we got married almost two years ago, and um, we had a great time, and we had, uh, you know, we were surrounded by people that we love, and it couldn't have been a better day. So, uh, that was the beginning of what is now a really, really wonderful marriage, and I'm thankful for her seriously every day. I don't know what I would do without her, um, and I just feel like, this is going to be really cheesy, but I feel more in love every day. And marriage is an awesome thing. Uh, and so it's great that in our country right now, I know today was the day that they heard arguments at the Supreme Court for marriage, marriage equality. And it is so worth it. And it's worth this fight that we're going through uh, as a country to get this all worked out so that people can be happy and live their lives with the people that they love. So there's that, and uh, what else? We moved. We, we live in a much bigger place now. Well, bigger for us. We still live in, in a condo, um, but we have more space now. This is our guest bedroom. What else? I'm, I'm in school. I went, to, I went back to grad school. I go to Georgetown, and I'm in their uh, women's health nurse practitioner and nurse midwifery program. So uh, something that I'm really, really, really excited to be doing is um, is having this new change in my career. I'll be moving into uh, attending births and helping women uh, during their pregnancies and also just all women. So that's something that I'm really passionate about and I get to make a difference in people's lives and in, in those amazing experiences. But going back to school is really hard, but I, I do feel like it's an incredible privilege to be able to do so. I, I try not to complain about it. Um, man, this is just so nice. I feel like we're we're catching up. We're we're getting back into the swing of things. I would love to hear uh, what's new in your lives. I feel like I was reading some of Jess's comments, and I was like, hey, I remember that person. I remember the, that uh, you know commenter and things like that. So I felt a little bit nostalgic reading that. And I really am looking forward to seeing the other videos to come. I feel like I'm with you and I'm like this fangirl that's like, oh my gosh, you look so good. And I want to hear all about your li life. And I want to, um, you know, be a, like a cheerleader and um, just be happy with everyone to see our faces back on here. Uh, what else? Oh, I've been doing a lot of yoga. I feel like that's a new thing in my life. The last... Uh, like year and a half, I guess. Been super into yoga. I have a place that I like to go to uh, near my home, and I've found that's a great thing to do to help balance life. So, been enjoying that. What else? I got glasses. That's new. My hair's longer. <laughs> Mary Beth said my hair's longer. Yes, that's true as well. I turned 30, uh, so this is what 30 looks like. Uh, I have to say though, I, I, thank you, honey. Um, I, I feel like 30 is great and anyone that tells you that turning 30 is terrible and you feel so old, uh, those people don't know how good they have it. So they should stop thinking that. I always say that getting older is a privilege and 
yeah, our bodies change and things, and they have since the day we were born, but I, um, I have to think that it's a, it's a really exciting time in, in my life where, you know, I'm moving into this new career, I have this great marriage, and I feel like I have my little family with my little puppies, Luna and Zara, and, uh, yeah, we're, we're excited, you know, this room, this room's a guest room right now, but... Uh, we painted the walls so that it would kind of transition into a baby's room one day um, in the not-so-distant future, but um, those are exciting things on the horizon. And I don't work midnights anymore. Woohoo! That's new since I last saw you. Um, I, I'm like one of, one of the day, so this is me, me during the day. <sighs> it's a lot better. It's a lot better. Um, I try not to remember how bad it was to work midnights for so long. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, so that's about it. Um, it. It is so good to see you all. Um, I do have Instagram, and I think that's all I have. I think I still have Twitter. Proud to be a dork. I'll put it down here or in the comments. I don't know how to edit things as well anymore. They changed. They, they changed my eye movie. <laughs> so, I don't know. All right, that's it. Thank you for watching. Um, stay tuned for the rest of the week for all of our favorite faces from the Beaver Bunch. And um, see you next Tuesday? No, probably not next Tuesday, but I had to say it for old time's sake. All right, bye everyone.